The Drop Can project is an incredible example of the commitment of Lindblad Expeditions by offering our ships as a platform for research here in the Galapagos Islands. The National Geographic's deep sea camera system is an awesome tool that we're getting to use here in the Galapagos Marine Reserve. It allows us to explore the communities that live in the deep sea parts of the ocean. This camera is essentially a glass sphere that has a camera inside and we attach a weight to it. This allows us to record and understand who's living and passing by in these deep sea waters. Globally, that seamounts are places where biodiversity accumulates in the deep sea. So we suspect that the Galapagos has really interesting deep sea communities. And so far, we're finding that so. We've already found deep water coral reefs here. We're finding lots of deep sea fish species and shark species. And uh, I think we're soon going to transform the species list in the Galapagos. It's probably going to double or triple once we actually fully survey the biodiversity down here. I love the ocean, I, but I really fell in love with it here in Galapagos. When, I, when you put a mask on here and you go underwater, just the amount of incredible biodiversity. I stumbled into the deep sea by accident when I started my job at the Charles Darwin Foundation. I think it's really important that we continue finding out what's there because if you don't know about something, then you can't fall in love with it. And we only protect what we love and we only love what we know. So we need to swim deeper or take cameras deeper to get information and learn about the wonderful creatures um, that want to show us uh, and teach us about their habitats.